welcome back everybody as you can see we are doing something a little different we are on Euro Truck Simulator this will be our first uh, Euro Truck video if all goes well um, we haven't done one of these yet we uh, played this game a bunch and uh, we haven't played it for too terribly long but uh, we were playing it a bunch and then we decided to start doing some YouTube videos and got all back into farm sim which we had kind of not been playing as much to play this so I asked farmer Jake if he wanted to farm tonight and he said no let's do some Euro truck so yeah here we are uh, let's see we we accepted a job to go from Stockholm, Sweden to Kalmar, Kalmar, Sweden. It's not very far, but uh, that's okay. It'll be a quick little short little run here just to do an episode, and I think we're even in the right parking lot here maybe from where Jake just uh, dropped something off so we'll see if we can uh, find our job here it should be yeah we were looking at this uh, picking up this uh, Caterpillar 422 it's 8 tons doesn't pay a whole lot but that's alright we got plenty of money in the bank there so you know we ain't worried about it we're just gonna have a little fun driving hauling a nice piece of kit there got our uh, Kenworth T800 I think is what it is we've uh, put quite a few miles on this uh, on this truck already we like this is one of our favorites we got a Peterbilt and uh is that our oh it's, it's snuck it in right there and we got a uh, an old school Kenworth cab over which is pretty cool too and sometimes is a a little easier to drive around on the European map over here but so yeah, it looks like we're picking up a little backhoe on a little boy. Perfect. Perfect. So my driving skills aren't quite what they used to be, but, uh, you know, we're still getting warmed up. Uh, Jake, what did you do to... Okay, there we go. Never mind. Thought uh, Farmer Jake did something and messed up our our camera view there, but looks like we're in good shape. Looks like it's going to be fun getting out of here. So it is a Friday evening as we record this video. And uh, we'll be getting up uh, at a decent time early in the morning and heading out to a Cub Scout camp out for Saturday night and Sunday. That should be fun. This will probably be, we'll probably be wrapping it up here after we record this little video if we ever get, uh, if we ever get to make a turn here. So we just downloaded the Scandinavian DLC not very long ago and the uh, I guess whatever the other one is uh, going east maybe so that's all kind of new to us so we haven't uh, explored much of uh, of these parts yet and I guess that guy's gonna let us go all right how about that so this is all some uh, some new terrain up here for us if you will Jake's been driving, so the truck's a little beat up there. We forgot to stop at a 
he gets mad at me when I say that stuff. So it could have been from me. But uh, normally before we pick up a load, we make a trip to the uh, service center and get things, uh, you know, let them bust out the duct tape and coat hangers and put stuff back together a little bit for us so we can make it to our our next destination, but not today. We're just going to have to roll with it and, you know, oh man, and then that guy, just this, they just come out of nowhere sometimes. Especially on those roundabouts, they just, I don't know, seems like that happens every time to me on the roundabouts, they just, boom, out of nowhere. It looks like they like the roundabouts here in Sweden. So yeah, haven't been playing this game much in a while since we've been learning how to do YouTube videos and kind of focus on doing the channel. We kind of got back into doing some farm sim, which we kind of been out of and playing this game quite a bit, but uh, I think we need to go back through and update some of our Jazzy Pack mods or whatever those are. And we had a trailer earlier that was just glowing red like it was radioactive. I don't think that was the way it was supposed to be. And There's been a few uh, updates to the game, I guess, since uh, since we downloaded all those. And So yeah, maybe we'll get that updated and you know, maybe we'll do some more uh, Euro Truck videos. hardest part about doing Euro truck videos is I think you gotta do a lot of talking and you know yeah right now things to talk about but so let's see what else is going on yeah we got our camp out it's gonna be fun it's gonna be pretty cold it's supposed to get down to 35 degrees tomorrow night so that'll be a little bit chilly but you know we'll survive uh, get some coffee going early in the morning and get the fire going and yeah it'll be all right some hot chocolate for the boys it'll be fun and Jake's been getting a little bored with the Bergmore map so he's been antsy to look at some other maps so we did look at the uh, Chillington extended map that came out and, and we've been watching uh, Ian Robson's series on, on the Chellington map so we're kind of familiar with it but the uh, I guess the new map the extended version came out last week or week before or something so we took a look at that and we no sooner than messed around on there one evening and then uh Apparently that uh, won the uh, straw poll for uh, Taff and Exile's uh, farm server map. They started on that, so we did download all the mods so we can so we can play on there. Don't know if we will, because we might try, but it, it's hard for us because with uh, Taff being in the UK, and also it seems like. That's never good. But it uh, seems like a lot of people that play on there are in the UK or at least kind of on that time zone. And uh, since we are here in uh, central United States, America, uh, there doesn't everybody seem there doesn't ever seem to be anybody on the server playing when uh, it's a convenient time for us in the evenings, I guess, you know, everybody seems to be playing on there at 1 or 2 o'clock or 
you know, start some of his streams and stuff at like 2 o'clock in the afternoon our time and yeah, that doesn't work out so good. Well, I'd love to play hooky and from work and, you know, play some farm sim, but yeah, can't do that all the time. <laughs> so, but, you know, we might try and sneak some sessions in and uh, since we've been messing around on the Chillington map anyways, since Jake's been bored, then figured I might as well go ahead and uh, download the rest of the mods that uh, he's using on the, his server there, so we can jump on there. We did play a little bit on uh, whatever the last map he had on there. Starts with a B, can't remember the name. But... Uh, that was right before when we were playing on there, right before we started doing the the YouTube channel, so we hadn't been on there very much either, been kind of focused on that, so. so yeah, just enjoying, uh, like I said, it's Friday evening, and oh, look at that, what's on that truck? It's a sprayer. Awesome. Been enjoying a little... Oh no, oh no! Hold on, folks. <laughs> Been enjoying a uh, little bit of Sam Adams Oktoberfest brew. Maybe you can tell by my driving. But that's all right. It is just a video game. We don't do that kind of stuff in real life. Hopefully the the audio setting works out all right, and and you can hear me okay. And yeah, whatever link 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 go ping. Whatever that said, we discovered. Oh, speed limit's only thirty. Wow. Just hauling balls through there. And another roundabout, my favorite. And another roundabout coming up. See? Oh, look at that. Looks like nobody's coming, and then bam. And all of a sudden, they're, they're everywhere. I don't know if we'll see an I Ikea truck or Ikea store while we're driving through Sweden here. I think that's where that stuff is. We just got our our first I Ikea store here in, in St. Louis. We don't live in St. Louis proper, but you know, we're just uh, we're in the suburbs, I guess, of St. Louis, if you will. And yeah, the Ikea store just, just opened. Last uh, whoa, last month I guess it was. So before that, the closest one was in Chicago, which is uh, five or five and a half hours away, something like that. I did take a. Uh, I had to. Uh, go to a cabinet delivery to a job site and got to drive uh, down to the country uh, this week that was that was kind of cool uh, if any of you follow me on Twitter I did uh, post a couple pictures of some tractors I found along the way that were for sale saw more than that but that was the only spot uh, that was convenient for me to uh, That was the only spot that was easy for me to stop and take a picture. But uh, I did drive past a lot where they had them on. Uh, they were doing like a consignment auction or something like that. Or selling uh, 
farm equipment on a consignment type of deal and I was wishing uh, Farmer Jake was with me because we they had a bunch of old harvesters and some neat tractors and all kinds of stuff but uh, and I got a speeding ticket would have been cool to walk through that lot and and take some pictures of stuff that was for sale but uh, I didn't have time I was I was working and I was on the clock and you know but it was a beautiful time of the year to, to drive into the, the country a little more saw some harvesters in the fields um, couldn't tell exactly what they were doing but uh, I know in one of the fields they were they had a, a combine and they were using an overloader wagon and transporting it over to a semi truck I was just driving by on the interstate so it was really kind of hard I didn't, didn't really get to see what kind of crops might have been in the field I think it might have been soybeans that they were doing uh, I did notice in a a lot of the fields uh, down there still had uh, soybeans in them that needed to be harvested so oh man really so yeah I saw that a lot of the fields when I was down that way still had uh, soybeans in them uh, most of the corn had been harvested it looked like and uh, yeah, it's just always, you know, it's a, a great time of the year in the fall to, to drive down that way and uh, see what's going on. Uh, the leaves are really pretty and alright. I'm a little distracted here with uh, Farmer Jake and the dog, so... <laughs> I'm just going to stop here for a minute and I'll be right back. Alright, we're back. Got the crisis to, uh, crisis solved there. Let's see if we can get back uh, moving here. So yeah, it was nice driving down in the country and that part of the... That area is uh, where I was, is where my ancestors came to this country. They immigrated here from... Germany and that's the uh, the part of the United States that they came to so you know, that was back in 1839 and if you've been watching any of our Bergmore series we talk about that at the beginning and it's part of the reason we chose that map but it's, uh, yeah it's always cool to be down in uh, in uh, in that area see what's going on down there my my folks are grew up in that area and I spend a lot of time in that area uh, as a kid in and around the, the farms there not on a farm per se exactly but uh, in the country where there were uh, lots of farms anyhow rocking through through Sweden here I guess speeding again apparently I do like this view sometimes but oh there it is so where did the hood ornament go it's uh you can see a lot more of the the view sometimes this way it's not as easy to drive but you can see the view a little better you can see all the scenery what's going on Earlier we were driving through Poland and it was like, uh, oh no, there we go, see, I guess that's what happens when you start to, 
Some of these start doing uh, videos and not paying attention. You miss your turns. We'll see if we can't. Nope. Yeah. We'll see if we can't. Uh, See if we can't whip a U-turn here into this uh, gas station. Hopefully that guy's gonna stop. coming from shift just get off at the Ikea store what's going on here we go oh after this guy all right we're making a run for it we got the bit we got the bigger vehicle they got to get out of our way at some point all right see if we can pay attention and and hit them make our turn here Farmer Jake's critiquing my driving skills. He said he could make that turn better than me. Yeah, all right, there we go. Boy, this ain't a very big road. Hope we're, uh, Farmer Jake says he would not be good on this road. Oh, so, yeah, it's a beautiful day. Oh, you know what? We need to get a, uh, how do we do that? We need to get us a, man, it's been, it's been so long. I don't, I don't remember how to do a, uh, there we go. Jump into photo mode here, and we got to get us a. Uh, why can't we? Uh, no, that's not what we wanted. An e. X. How do we? Uh, how do we look around? No, that only does that. Pan. Oh, yeah, I like this. Okay. Oh, no, no. Sorry, everybody. play with a a 360 controller so how do we go down up down is the e we think farmer Jake that make a good one for our thumbnail for this video that's not too bad huh doesn't look like we have our cool lights on, but that's all right. All right. All right. There we go. Now we got us a thumbnail before we get to there. I think this is our delivery right here, so. Coming in. 
Ooh, look at this. We haven't been to a. We haven't been to a facility like this yet. Just take the easy park on this one. Satisfactory, that's all right. We're, we're a little out of practice. We'll take it. Get some experience points. All right. Well, thanks for watching. If you enjoy the uh, video, feel free to leave us a like or subscribe to the channel or leave us a comment. But uh, I am your host, uh, Zigzaggy, with and. Uh, Keep on trucking and we'll see you next time.